Well, hello again, all my fluid art friends. It's Doris at DF Designs. Welcome to my channel. Or if you are new, or if you're new, welcome to my channel. And if you're returning, welcome back to my channel. But for those of you who haven't subscribed yet, please do. It helps the channel out, and it's free. Um, I some of you saw this last night on Wednesday night. I tried to do a chain pull. I'm going to be honest, it doesn't look like I wanted it to, so I'm going to redo it, and I'm going to do it hopefully better, because I know that my base coat was too thick, so I've got some black, because I didn't want to try to go over it with white, so I'm going to go over it with black, and I made this thin. So it'll hopefully spread out. I put a line down and I had ran the chain through it but I didn't clean off the chain as it was uh, as I was putting it on the canvas and it, I think it had way too much paint so what I'm gonna do tonight is I'm gonna put a little bit of the paint from the bottle into this cup not thinning it down any and what I don't use can go back in the cup let me see uh, try and make sure you can see all of it there we go okay so now okay I'm gonna pick up a chain and I'm gonna dunk it and I'm gonna need a stick to help it dunk because obviously it doesn't want to go. Nope, that's not getting enough paint off. So, let me do what I said I was going to do. I did forget my glass of water that it should go in, but I can stop the tape and go get it real quick after this. Okay, there we go. Oh, that looks so much better. Now, as you're dragging it, I de I've been watching a lot of other people's videos. And as you're dragging it, you want to make sure you're picking up the chain so it doesn't get covered in black. And you know what? I know what I can do for the water. Just put some water in that cup and deposit my chains in there. Ha! 
Okay, well, there's one petal. I'm going to do five big ones, four smaller ones, and then hopefully three heart-shaped ones in the middle. Okay. Okay, got paint all over it now. I'm going to run it through my fingers. Try not to drip. You want to kind of overlap the petals a little bit. And there goes another siren, so I apologize again. But I can't close the window or I'll be dying of hotness in this room. And there's a nice breeze outside is why I wanted it open. I just didn't know everybody was going to have emergencies while I was trying to film. Okay. Get the majority of the paint off. See, this has turned out much better because I've got less base coat and less paint on the chain. Okay, there we go. Now you want to lift it up as it starts picking up black or you won't have a petal there. You'll have just black. Okay, in the water. Uh, now, let me turn it just a little bit so I can get it at a better angle. I want to try to do two petals right here. So, dunk the chain into the paint. Clean it off. Clean off my finger. Okay, and I'm going to start this petal here. See, basically what you want to do right here is, is you just want to look at where half of it is at. And then that way you know. Okay, there we go. It starts picking up too much black or too much base coat because, you know, if you're doing it with white, it would be different. You want to kind of uh, do that. Well, still doesn't look centered. I don't know why I can't get it centered. Okay, now let me do my last one. And while I'm doing this, I do want to tell you, um, I'm hoping to post this either Thursday night or Friday afternoon. And this Sunday, being Mother's Day, is a special live. Everybody's going to get a gift. All you got to do is pay for shipping, but you'll get to pick the color. See, I wouldn't worry, don't worry about the inside part of the petal because you're going to cover it up with more petals. You want to get the majority of the outside. And now I can, oops, shoot. Now I can tell you right now, I'm going to need to pick up some of that black. So what I'm going to do is, is I'm just going to tap it to pick some of it up with the spatula. Kind of like what designer Gemma 77 does. I have pipettes, but I, I know how hard it can be to pick up paint with pipettes. Okay, now we're going to do the next row of petals. Yay! Okay, and I'm going to do four of those. Uh, 
I hope you can still let me see uh, my hands in the way I apologize okay now clean it off clean off my finger and I'm gonna make these four kind of overlap the inside one okay there's one okay and number two basically I did the five and now what I'm trying to do is, is I'm, I'm trying to do the four like on all four sides and then that should give me a good good place to start with my um with my three and get rid of that these are the same chains I used last night I just put them in a bowl of water and believe it or not I really didn't have to even clean them I just had to rinse them off a little bit there wasn't any paint on it okay try try not to get too far under the black or your red disappears and I can see some more black I should pick up right here because that's what happens is you're dragging the black towards the middle okay now I'm gonna do another little one over there now I'm not editing this video okay what you see is what you get today because I just want to put it up as my kind of like my redemption chain pull after last night's both of them turned out awful oh let me tell you but that was I think one of the very ever first uh, chain pulls I did that wasn't just the squiggly flower where you pull it straight down off the canvas okay okay in the water up a little bit of that black and now do one more right there and then I will be ready for my three little ones just dunking it underneath the paint cleaning off most of the excess and then laying it down There we go. Now pull it this way. Pull it up. Okay, and I see a big glob of black I've got to get rid of. Oops, <laughs> almost knocked my cup over. okay now I got three smaller chains to make some little petals in the middle not sure how how big I'm gonna be able to make them I got to admire Heather Wright art for for coming up with this technique right here of the way you do it um, but she she does use just her hand to clean the paint off instead of a glove well I'm sorry I don't wanna I'm not Tish I don't want to get my hand 
completely dirty. I don't want to become one with the paint when there's this much paint. Okay, clean my finger off. Oops, nope, I want this one to go right there. I don't think I'm gonna be able to get rid of that all that black right there without disturbing the petals. Let me see if I can. Yeah didn't disturb them too bad okay last of the three in the middle and then I may do a little bit of swirling in the very very middle and I haven't decided yet got a lot of black up oh, put it back in the wrong cup <laughs> I just tried to put it back in my paint cup <laughs> hey I wasn't paying attention well let me see if I have uh, another chain somewhere over here that I could use yeah here's a here's a very very short one I just want to do a little round center in the very middle of this. There we go. Now, that's just to try to cover up the black. Well, it's not working on covering up the black. Let me see if I can get some of this red to go over there. There you go. Well, I really don't want to mess with it anymore. I think I got a rose this time. Y'all tell me down in the comments what you think. I don't have a torch. Um to do air to pop the air bubbles so I'm kind of stuck on that part so don't forget to come Sunday um, on my channel I do it every Sunday and I usually give away one painting but th this being Mother's Day I thought I would give everybody a chance to, to win or get, get a free piece of artwork for just the cost of shipping they're just going to be four by four tiles okay um i don't know if i should do this or not but i'm just trying to smooth that out just a little bit so take a look at the 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 one at the beginning okay i'm not sure if i post if i'm going to be able to post a picture i don't know if i took a picture of it last night but tell me what y'all think did i finally get it this time and i want to thank everybody for coming in and watching y'all are awesome i love all my subscribers my old ones and my new ones don't forget to click the little like button if you did like the video. Share it with your friends if you think they might want to see it. And all I can really say is I love the fluid arts right out of you. And bye for now.